back to our video. In today's video, we are actually going to be building like um, a Chevy Silverado on bigger rims. So kind of a dunk, kind of not-ish. But yeah, it's going to be slammed. It's going to look super nice, which I haven't made one of these builds in a very long time. So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing, which just trust the process. Things going to look good. And yeah, so hope you guys enjoy. If you guys enjoy, like and subscribe. We're on our way to 12,000 subscribers. Let's try to get 50 likes. And here we go. So we're just going to hop in. So I honestly didn't really think much through this. So I don't know which rims or anything I'm going to do. But I kind of have an idea. So what would these rims look like all lower down? Or should I do like that kind of rim? I don't know. It's a tough decision, actually. I don't know which ones I should do. Like if I did this in white and then I you guys just you guys will see okay and I also want to put eh I don't know those tires actually kind of look good on it they don't look too bad so for the window tint I'm gonna do super dark I'm gonna do glossy like this okay that does not look too bad but or I might do chrome I don't know yeah I still have to make up my decision I don't know yet but we probably will change it around a few times, but yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna need these lights. Uh, it's not gonna be a diesel, I know. It's rare, I'm not making a truck of diesel on here. I usually make everything diesel, but okay. Which, I wish I, wish I could make this truck a single cab. Like a single cab short bed like this. Perfect, but it's crew cab. Yeah, I like the lower trucks. The lower trucks, they look better um, single cab, I think, in my opinion. Okay, so that doesn't look too bad. I think that's good. Let's do... I think I'm going to go with... S mm. Independent suspension is kind of what it's supposed to have. But I don't know if I want to put that. Okay, here we go. Let's lower down the rear a little bit. So, okay, here we go. Travel. Let's go down a little bit more. Uh... Now I gotta make it lower than this. Yeah. I should just make it all the way down. Okay. Travel. Lower down. Yeah, I want it completely slammed like this. So now, the rims. Okay, so those look good for the rims. Rim size. So I want this, the front width, to be a little bit more in like that. And, okay, it doesn't look too bad. Now I want the rear. Can I make the rear a little bit wider? Okay, yeah, there we go. Oh, it doesn't look too bad so far. My problem is the leaf springs. One, I'm going to need them to be a little bit higher up. Just like that. Leaf springs, need them higher up. And, okay, that doesn't look too bad. I like it, I like it. Okay, let's do all these upgrades. Just where all my money and gold goes to. Yeah, I like these kind of builds. I just haven't built them in a while. But we're going to make this one turboed. So yeah, it's going to be a turbo one. Okay, it doesn't look too bad. I like it, I like it. And, okay, how does this look? Let's look at it first. I could do some badges and stuff on it. Oh, the... How does that pop out on this side? The tire. Oh, the axle shifted a little bit over. That's going to bother me if I don't fix that. Okay, so let's make the width a little bit in a little bit more. I'm happy I caught that before. I drove. Okay. This side's good. Okay, pretty nice, pretty nice. And yeah, so that's the build. So we're going to go drive it around a little bit. Oh, and this thing is rolling. It looks not too bad. Looks pretty cool when it's rolling like that. Which I wish I could um make my axle width even smaller where I could put wires in a rear, but a little bit wider, but... That's okay for now. I do like this. Let's go into photo mode so we can look at it. Oh, yeah, that thing looks pretty good. I don't know. I wish I could do... I don't know. It doesn't look exactly how I planned it as it looking, but it does look pretty good. I just wish I I should have put more deep dish wheels on it. It would have looked a little bit better in my opinion. But, yeah, it doesn't look too bad for now. And it feels a single cab. All for that was just really should add that option when they get a chance where we could do that on at least a few of the trucks. 
that would be pretty awesome. Okay, and you guys in the comment section rate what you guys think of it, which I know this um, truck, uh, this type of build is not for everyone, and yes, I know that. But remember, guys, if you guys enjoyed the video, like and subscribe. We're on our way to 12,000 subscribers. Let's try to get 50 likes. Thank you all for watching, and everyone, peace out. Bye.